I feel like killers need to have a lot more iridescent just to keep up, you know? Um, with these comms players. I feel like that. My solution was, and I said this online, so you'll catch me on that. Catch, catch me on YouTube. Um, is that um, I really feel like players should be solo every time. Like, friends should not be able to identify one another. Uh, it's nice, it's fun playing with others, it really is. But when you calms it out, it's just unbalanced. Something's gotta, something's gotta happen, man. So, um, it makes it hard for everybody um, when you're on comms because, again, you know, the, the perks are, for both survivors and killers, are balanced, you know, for solo build. Um, and so when you're all comms and you're all experienced, you know, there's no... I, I, not to say that it's not fun when you, um, when you play, um, you know, a little bit more aggressively. Um, you know, I, I'm a more laid-back player. I don't get all aggressive and just try to kill, kill, kill. Um, I like I like the actual game. Um, but when they're just hyper-aggressive and it's just, you know... And sometimes it's about bullying the killer. Um, that's that's not fun either. I don't think that's a good way to play. I mean, nobody can tell you how to play the game, honestly. But it's just not how I like to. And I know based on the comments online that it's very common sentiment. So there's a little bit of my message about that. Um, how, uh, you know, maybe how to balance it and some of the challenges of playing a killer. And why... I still enjoy playing a killer, but man, every single game used to be fun, and it's not anymore. It's like maybe twenty five percent of them are fun because um, people just and and I just think people get more, you know, they get more experience and they get bored. Anyway, my two cents.